All right, guys. Uh, welcome to my new video tutorial. Uh, I've been offered by Bit the Founder to write a review uh, about their product, um, Bit the Founder Antivirus for Mac. And so I installed it, and I have several problems here uh, that I hope the software will help me fix, uh, especially with mail. Uh, I discovered some malware uh, with Clamax AV um, and I eliminated but probably there's something still uh, left on the system so now I will try and make system scan and see what we can find here uh, going to pass the video for this. The installation is very straightforward so you only have to run the package here and you'll be requested to enter your license key or to go for a trial. Um, they gave me a license for one year so I'm pretty mm, good to go and I will resume the video when the scan is done. Alright, the scan is over and no result has been found. But the better test and uh, bit defender antivirus for Mac, I'm gonna uh, create a copy of a Mac virtual machine and I'm going to infect it with as many viruses uh, as I can find and see how the product does. How you doing folks? Uh, so I created a Yosemite virtual machine and I installed several pirated software uh, containing malware to test Bitdefender uh, antivirus for Mac. Uh, after uh, infecting the system, I installed the antivirus and ran a full system scan, which lasted not too long, 50 minutes. Pretty decent time compared to other products like Climax AV. And it actually could detect uh, a nasty malware for Mac iWare which forced several people to reformat their iMacs and turns your iMac into a bot. Okay folks, uh, so I created another virtual machine and now I use the same part of the software to infect the machine again and I'm going to test uh, Avast antivirus for Mac on this virtual machine to see how it does. Alright, I'm trying to download Avast antivirus for Mac. And one thing I noticed that I don't like at all is that the official Avast antivirus page redirects you here to this page here uh, asking you to click this part. Afterwards, okay, if you don't pay attention, it'll uh, force you to download some junk that you don't actually need, like uh, especially this one, MacKeeper, is really harmful. Uh, I really recommend against it. So that's a turn off for me in the first place.
Okay, folks, uh, you can see the solution is pretty slow. Uh, slower, surely, than Bet Defender, and it'll take uh, still a while for it to be completed. So I'm going to pause the video for a while. Alright, that was only to download the virus definitions. I'm still installing the software as you can see um, and it's pretty slow. In my opinion they bundled too many applications in a single package here. One thing I noticed that I don't like is this Chrome installation that comes afterwards because I, this is something I deeply dislike because uh, first of all I already have Chrome and I'm not big on it I use it only in certain cases and second of all if I want to install another browser, I can do it myself. Thanks. So, with that, I'm going to perform a full system scan. So, I don't know how long it's going to take, and I'm going to pause the video for a while until it gets completed. So, see you guys in a few. Alright, Avast has completed the scan and it took a little less than Bitdefender, 27 minutes uh, against 50. And it picked up on the viruses I had installed in the system, which is essentially the iWorm malware. But, uh, like um, a vast. There are four, four files that he was unable to scan. I don't know what, why. And Bitdefender actually had detected two more files that uh, a vast didn't detect. So we can say the performance and results are pretty similar. What's more, uh, Bitdefender automatically cancelled the file for us, while here we had to delete them manually. Clicking here. Okay, no biggie, but probably an automatic deletion would be more appreciated. The reason why I compared Avast and free antivirus from Mac with Bitdefender uh, is that uh, Avast is considered the first uh, one in this list uh, from this independent report on antivirus software uh, that one of my networking teachers has signaled to me and that's a pretty reputable website, uh, avcomparatives.org. Mm. This analysis shows uh, that Bitdefender is a reliable antivirus uh, that can effectively protect your computer um, against the most recent um, Mac malware. So you may want to take advantage of the giveaway uh, of this product on my blog. I'm not a salesperson, so uh, if you want, there's a free giveaway of the product uh, organized uh, by Bitdefender. Um, and I'm 
wouldn't participate in this if I didn't believe in the product. So if you want to take advantage of it, uh, you're good to go. Thank you for following me and for watching this video and have a good one and keep following.